I thought of a good idea to do a video would be to show you guys what's in my um, makeup bag or my like my travel makeup bag. Um, I usually carry this to my boyfriend's um, over the weekend, and really I just pack all my necessities and my everyday stuff, you know. So I figured I would just show you guys probably my basic stuff, and it might not be that interesting, but um, I figured it would kind of narrow it down. I'm gonna start off with my basic foundation products and my two foundations that I do mix together um, is the Revlon Color Stay and I'm in ivory because I haven't started tanning as you can tell and then the next one is the True Match and I'm in the color Warm and these are both very good foundations very full coverage and together they're just like a perfect um, foundation so I use those two and I usually apply it with, it just kind of applies it very well and all over the skin. And then after I apply that, the powder that I use is the Dream Matte Powder. I actually mentioned this in my favorites. And I use this with a, um, Kaduki. <laughs> um, I use this and this together, which is my Kaduki brush. And I absolutely love this brush. Like, this is my must-have, um, whenever I'm using powder any kind of powder pretty much so yeah after that I use um, like for concealer I use my um, bare minerals foundation as a concealer like on my um, problem areas and underneath my eye which um, really do help like if I have foundation in my eye um, as a base and then put this on it it has a really great coverage I don't apply this all over my face just because I've already used the powder, so I just use this for concealer, which really works. I will go ahead and fill in my brows, which I use this little brow kit. I don't use this every day, but um, if I feel like my hair is looking on the darker side, and since I got it done and have this dark next to my face, um, I kind of feel like my eyebrows will be washed out. So um, I've been using this brow kit, and I think it's by Milani, yeah, Milani, and it's called Brow Fix Brow Kit. And um, it has the three colors, is the highlight, the brow, and then the brow two, which I don't use this dark color, I just use this one, and it's dark enough for me. And then after I do that, I just take my uh, brow brush and just kind of comb those out. And then I go ahead and use my lash curler, and it is just the Walmart brand Studio Basics. Nothing special. It does its job. Um... Um, um, um. Also, I forgot to mention my blush. My For my blush, I just used my e.l.f. blending brush. And the blush that I carry with me usually is CoverGirl's. Um, I'm not sure what color this is. This is the one that has, like, the sparkles in it. Um, the color is not no longer on the back of it, so I don't know what color it is. Sorry. But this brush works amazing. It's just the right angle, you know. So, and also for concealer, whenever I was saying I use the Bare Minerals, I apply it with the Bare Minerals brush. Or it might be, this might be another, I think this is like Bare Essentials brush. And it's just a smaller brush to apply it to my blemishes and underneath my eye. Elf Liquid Liner, which is amazing and is my current favorite liquid liner right now. And it's in black, of course. And then the pencil liner is from Sephora. This is just a basic cream liner. This is kind of comparing to the 24-7 by Urban Decay, but this was in a set, I think. So my favorite little thing I've been using underneath my eye for eyeliner is this little sponge tip applicator with my 24-7 eye tattoo, or color tattoo, not eye tattoo. And, and it's the gray color. It's called Audacious Asphalt. This was in my favorites as well and like I said I just apply it underneath my eye as eyeliner which works very well it stays amazingly and then for my primer I just use um, you know the Urban Decay primer potion and then all I take for eyeshadow oops, all I take for eyeshadow is my Naked Tooth palette um, I wear it pretty much every day I don't really have any need for any other palette right now I do still like to mess with other palettes but not like taking other places all and then I have my acne medication as well and then my brushes I have um, this one's like a little flat top 
or flat brush. It's not really flat top, I guess, but it has the flat side and then the blending side, which I love this blending side. It helps do the smoky eye so well and it gets in the crease. So that's pretty much all of my makeup bag. I carry on this other pocket side, I just carry my jewelry and stuff that I need to keep with me. Yeah, so that's all that's in my makeup bag. It's probably the same thing. That's not my um, pocketbook makeup bag. That will be included in a separate video um, in my What's My Purse video. So let me know what you think about my hair. Um, like if you want me to do tutorials and stuff with my new hairstyle. And if you think I should get more um, of this brown put through the blonde. I haven't decided yet. She said that um, it would look good or we could do that later on. So I'm, I'm thinking about it. But just let me know and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.